This is Bryce from the Rambler Review reporting from the McBain track. On May 2nd, the McBain community will be asked to go to the polls to vote on a bond to allow the district to purchase a new track for the community. Here to explain the current track situation is Coach Pat Maloney. The track gets used for varsity contests, practice of course, also the middle school uses as well as NMC, and our youth day programs where kids are uh, running around the track. We also have uh, community members that walk the track and use it uh, for health reasons. There's a couple of things that, uh, you know, they, that have been band-aided over the years. We have a numerous cracks to the foundation of the track, um, especially our, anybody that hurdles if they're landing, a number of hurt lanes have cracks in them that show you land just right and you're, you're gonna trip and fall, so it's, it's a hazard. Uh, there, our, our long jump area, uh, we, we have difficulty with the running area. Uh, it's been, our, we've got a great job. Uh, Dollar's been a great custodian in terms of working out the, the pit year in and year out, trying to make it usable, and she's patched it so many times that we probably can't count. Um, Hopefully the you know it's just one of those things that it's the band-aid has worked for a while but it's now it's beyond that type of repair. Uh, our our starting and a number of lanes have come down to there's large holes there there's no uh, the rubberized track is gone we're just sitting at asphalt and <clears throat> we also at our high jump area have difficulty uh, it's just worn out it's it, it, it's the foundation itself is very wavy and uh, the the takeoff spot is war right down to blacktop as well so you're wearing a spike and again it becomes a health a hazard uh, injury possibility uh, so those are a couple of big ones well we've had a number of coaches uh, talk about that you know especially for hurdle events uh, trying to switch lanes so they're not in a couple of especially lane six seven uh, where hurdlers are are landing in a spot landing in a crack that could end up becoming uh, an injury. Uh, the high jump pit area where takeoff is happening, it's down to asphalt, and so a kid wears a spike and they're like, they're slipping, and especially when it rains, we have pooling of uh, water in the high jump area. So a number of coaches, it makes it difficult. You know, they you know they're not going to want to come to our meets. Um, it's hard for us to host a meet um, because of these uh, you know, deficiencies in our track. In addition, two years ago, the Highland Conference Track Championship was moved from McBain to a new location because of the condition of the track. Reporting from the Rambler Review, this is Bryce Aikum.